your orthodontic diagnosis just got easier. Instead of spending time manually measuring individual teeth and arch length, you can now get all of this critical data instantly right inside of Blue Sky Plan. This video will show you how our new ortho module feature provides immediate tooth dimensions and arch length, helping you solve space analysis and tooth size discrepancies more accurately and efficiently than ever before. Viewing the width of individual teeth is simply a click of a button. In the visibility panel, simply click the teeth widths checkbox. You could see that the width of each individual tooth now shows up next to the relevant tooth. You can view a single jaw by deactivating both jaws in the bottom left on the icon right here. You can change the active jaw simply by clicking on the opposing arch. If both jaws are visible, you could change the active jaw just by clicking on the relevant jaw. The total length of the arch as a sum of each individual tooth is visible as well at the end of the arch. If we would like to measure the length of the arch with the curve in different positions, this can be done as well. Simply choose the snap to curve option, confirm that show curve checkbox is checked, and click the edit curve button. You now have the option of grabbing the nodes along the curve to drag them to the desired position. You could see that the total curve length visible on screen adjusts accordingly. If needed for improved visibility, the height positioning of the curve can be raised by grabbing with your left mouse button the red square in the middle and dragging it accordingly. The rotational positioning of the curve can be adjusted if needed as well by using the blue arrows in the middle of the curve by grabbing and dragging with your left mouse button. The midline positioning of individual teeth can be viewed by clicking the checkbox for teeth midlines. We can now see the green indicator line on each tooth, indicating the width of the tooth and where that measurement is taking place. If that needs to be adjusted, simply click on the relevant tooth to activate it. Click the adjust midlines button that we have here on the bottom right. And now the widget allows you to rotate the midline without moving the position of the tooth. We could see that as we adjust the midline positioning, the measurement for the relevant tooth adjusts accordingly as well. Click the Adjust Midlines button once again to deactivate the functionality.